guys let's look at the funnetry system so in the previous in the previous video we looked at articulatory system now funnetry system in this funnetry system as i already told you in the previous videos we have a larynx okay remember what we have in funnetry system larynx in the examinations they may ask you so what is there in a funnetry system so in funnetry system we have a larynx i hope you understand this what is this larynx so larynx is also called voice box voice box it has another name that's called adams apple adams apple remember this is called adams apple this larynx is called adams apple so within this larynx we have another important part or organ that's called that's called vocal cords remember this vocal cords vocal cords so what happened in this funnetry system when we generally when we breathe in and breathe out these vocal cords let me show you what are these these vocal cords these are the vocal cords these vocal cords generally they are they become open when you breathe in and be, breathe out but but when we speak sometimes these vocal cords are wide open right so what is there in vocal cords let's see first thing so there this is these are called these are called vocal cords and uh, this part the the space between the vocal cords this space is called this space is called epiglottis this space is called glottis these two are vocal cords one two so these are vocal cords these are vocal cords the space is called glottis and here the top part of this is called epiglottis epiglottis okay this is the funnetry system so what happens see when we speak when we speak certain sounds certain sounds like there are nine sounds pa ta kha etc there are nine sounds when we say pa etc these vocal cords wide open like this okay when these vocal cords are wide open and we uh, uh, sounds are produced so we call them voiceless sounds voiceless sounds voiceless that means they just uh, go out okay so these vocal cords are wide apart certain sounds like a ba da okay for example when you say ba see or you can say sa z for example sa and z so you can understand when you say sa freely move so this is voiceless sound but when you come to z sound so there will be vibration in the vocal cords okay there are 15 voiced sounds these are voiced sounds okay this is a phonetic system okay i hope you understand in a phonetic system what we have larynx and the larynx is on the top of uh, trachea okay windpipe and you know that what windpipe and food pipe and in this larynx we have a vocal cords vocal cords vocal cords can be wide open and they come closer also so when you produce some sound if the vocal cords are wide open 
and then they are called voiceless if they are come together and make any vibration then they are called voice sounds thank you guys